I'm Sierra Jackson, Miss District of Columbia, and you're watching Branching Out. I'm Dottie Peoples, and you're watching Branching Out. Hi everyone, I'm Glory Goban from Bass Wives LA and you just caught me on Branching Out. Hi, we're the Braxtons and you're watching Branching Out. You are watching Branching Out. Wow, you look beautiful. Thank you. Alright, hey, it's Blair Runner, we're watching Branching Out. Bobby Joe's and I branch it out for real. And it's a beautiful thing. Branch now. And I'm just excited to be back to celebrate the 20th anniversary. Are you excited about tonight? I am very excited about tonight. I cannot wait to perform and show these girls that we love them for this foundation. I am very excited to be here with my favorite dance team. They taught me how to do a lot, and I'm very excited to perform and show everybody what we're capable of. Yes. I am very excited today, actually. I love to dance. It's my passion, and I love to show these girls that they don't have to set back. They can just go free and dance their heart out. I am very excited because these are my sisters because we love each other very much and we are very excited to perform with each other. My name is Tyra Jones. I'm 12 and I attend the Jewel Dance Academy. My name is Josiah Love Jones. I am 10 years old and I, and I am a part of the Elite Jewel Dance Academy. My name is Taylor Diane Jones. I am 10 years old and I am a part of the Elite Jewel Dance Academy. My name is Michaela Erica Ferguson. I am 11 years old and I attend the Jewel Dancing Elite Academy. Looking forward to the uh, Motherless Daughter Foundation tonight. What, what are your part? What are you gonna do tonight? You gonna tell me? Huh? What's your name? No. How old are you? Three. Oh. So what's your name? Huh? Two. Wow. So you looking forward to having fun tonight? What are you looking forward to tonight at the Motherless Daughters Foundation? Well, I'm so excited to be able to see my big Miss DC sister. Um, Sarah Elizabeth Langford reed was a former Miss District of Columbia in 03. Um, and being able to see her again, I'm super excited about that. I'm super excited to sing tonight. I'll be singing Almost There from The Princess and the Frog, which is a great song for young girls. And also, I'm excited to meet these young ladies. I think that they're really going to be inspiring. I don't think I'll just inspire them, but I think they'll inspire me too. Be sure to follow me um, at Sierra D. Jackson on Instagram and Sierra D. Jackson underscore on Twitter and follow my website SierraJackson.com. Thanks so much. Well, I'm really the, an honorary mom for the organization. Uh, I set myself up to do that because I realized that these girls start off with a deficit. Because I can remember as old as I am now, I remember the pearls of wisdom from my mother. Right. You know, from early ages that your mother is so important the guidance, even when you don't want to hear it. You know, That's when we are growing up, you don't want to hear what you had to say. That's right. But they still are with me today. Mm -hmm. So I want to be that inspiration to them to say to them, whatever has happened to you, mm -hmm. you had nothing to do with it. It's not your fault. That's right. So you take what God has given you, some talent, mm -hmm. some uh, persistence, mm -hmm. some goals, and work with that. Okay. Don't worry about what your environment is. Yes. So that's what I'm trying to say to them. That's mm -hmm. right. Well, thank you, Ms. Clayton. And continue to do what you do, and we love you. We are at the Motherless Daughters Foundation, and we are watching Branching Out.
The board of directors of this organization works all the time to try to see to it that what we would want for the girls, they get done. And Rosalind is just beyond description. Let's just give her a hand and just take a picture of all the girls. She works tirelessly for them. So when you see them again, they'll be at Harvard. They're going to be discoverers. They're going to be scientists. They're going to do great work because you're here to help us infuse in them that enthusiasm to be somebody. Many are searching for a safe place, and we know how that feels to not have someone to talk to and to relate with. A lot of our young women are in trouble, they feel alone, and they need a woman's presence in their life. Motherless Daughters Foundation provide that safe place that helps these girls connect with women that may not be their maternal mother, but feels the same way to help them accomplish the goals and dreams that they need to do. It is my pleasure and the pleasure of the Motherless Daughters Foundation to present this honor to Senator Donzella James. Every level. 